Africa is a continent full of wonder, some known to man and many yet to be discovered. In celebration of our continent's beauty and mystique, we'll be looking at some of the wonders it has to hold. Welcome to the Mysteries of Africa series where we take a look at Africa's most mysterious sights and sounds. Before we continue, please take the time to subscribe and hit the notification bell. In today's video, we take you to Ethiopia. At the shores of Lake Tana hide a number of monasteries that for years have been guarding treasures from foreign intruders and against the passage of time. For those who know where to find it, it only takes a boat ride to reach them. For those who don't, it remains a mystery. The Lake Tana area has always held great importance. In the 14th, 15th and 16th centuries, it played the role of maintaining the Christian faith against contemporary pressures. Many of the earliest manuscripts and precious examples of art as well as royal objects were safely stored on its island. Lake Tana is home to about 37 islands. 20 of these islands shelter churches and monasteries of significant historical and cultural interests. Once you get off the boat and decide which monastery you'd like to visit, a friendly priest welcomes all the visitors and is happy to show you the ancient manuscripts stored there. The monasteries reflect the native building traditions with their round shape, materials used and building techniques. Each one consists of three parts, the inner sanctuary, the inner ambulatory and the outer ambulatory. Some of the churches on the island include Debre Mariam, Daga Stefanos, Narga Selassie, Tana Cherkos, and Kebran Gabriel. Unfortunately, although it is said to be one of the most beautiful and atmospheric of the monasteries of Lake Tana Island, Kebre Gabriel is no longer open to the public. It was founded in the 14th century and rebuilt in the 17th century. The island is also home to a number of birds. If you're a bird lover, you should make a point of visiting the island. Near the eastern side of the lake is a breeding base for a number of wetland species. Lake Tana Islands are also home to one of the most precious hidden gems. Tana Cherkos is a small island monastery where it is said that the Ark of the Covenant was hidden for 800 years before being brought to its final resting place in Aksum. What more better way to add mystery to the islands? If you wish to plan a trip to any of the churches, you can easily do so by hiring a boat from the Maritime Transport Authority based in Bahir Dar. The nearest monastery, Kebran Gabriel, is about two hours round trip. Definitely worth it. What are your thoughts about today's video? Is this a place you'd love to add to your bucket list? Let us know in the comments down below. Have you ever been there? We'd love to hear your experience. Let us know of any other mysterious places you'd love us to cover. Thank you for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please do so and hit the notification bell. If you've enjoyed today's video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, make sure to watch our other videos which celebrate our Mama Africa. We have the Mysteries of Africa series and the Amazing People of Africa series. Clips used in this video are from Habesha Traveler. Be sure to head on over to her channel and check her out. She has amazing African travel content. Link to her channel shall be in the description below. It's been me, Linda from Tuna Travel. Be sure to check out my YouTube channel. Until the next video, stay safe and remember, Africa is watching.